All right. So the members of Torch, I know, um, including yourself, you play in a few other bands and one of my personal favorites, Shitstorm. Um, so how much time does music take up of your life? You know, obviously you're on the road with Torch. Is this is music something that you do as a completely full-time gig or when you guys get home, do you go back to the day jobs or like your studies, anything like that? Like, how um, Definitely not studying. Uh, <laughs> but uh, no, me personally, um, when I'm not on the road, uh, I, I record bands back home. I have a studio, you know, where we recorded Harmonicraft. Um, I run that with my friend uh, Ryan, who's uh, Ryan Half, who's born or whatever. Uh, he plays in Capsule, another awesome South Florida band. Cool. And so we share the space. You know, he works while I'm on the road, and vice versa. And we've been lucky to work with a lot of cool bands. So that's what I do when I'm home. Awesome. You know, but we are uh, pretty much six months or a little over six months of the year uh, on the road. Right on. So. You know, it's pretty much, yeah, my entire life is just music. I hear you. All around. And I, I'm, I'm definitely into that. I kind of maybe never thought it would be, but it's been rad, no regrets. And I think I'm at a point in my life where I'm enjoying it and having more fun. And I don't know, I'm just more amped than ever to be doing this. Just 24-7 music nonstop. Awesome. Very cool. Any recording projects that are uh, lined up that you're particularly looking forward to? Um, really looking forward, uh, forward to... Uh, uh, wrapping up a Shitstorm LP that we're oh. doing. It's like, you know, 17 songs, like six, seven minutes. Awesome. And uh, I just finished, <laughs> actually, our sound guy, Rob, I finished uh, a seven inch for his band that I'm really pumped on. I think it does their music, you know, justice. Uh, their na the name of their band is Rapturous Grief. Okay. And they'll be touring up. You'll probably see them out here soon enough. Cool. But, yeah, just a few projects. You know, there's some uh, talks of a capsule uh, record or recording coming coming up soon when I get home. Awesome. So, I don't know, staying busy. You know. Right on. Very cool. So as we head into 2013, what's uh, what's Torch have on the plate? Have you guys started to think about you know tours for next year? Any new recordings in the works? And yeah. What's on the slate? All of that. Um, <laughs> we're uh, we recorded two brand new songs right before this tour, and the trust the test presses, Jesus, test presses are in now, and we just need to approve them. And we're gonna have a, a two song seven inch uh, that'll be out late November, early December. Okay. And we had John Santos who did the artwork for Home Craft. He did the artwork for the seven inch. We're pumped on that. Awesome. Some people might, you know, notice that it's a homage to something they may have seen before. Okay. Uh, but yeah, we have that. Uh, pretty stoked on that. Uh, we played those songs tonight actually. Um, and I, th I think the idea is uh, when we get home, just ha uh, we have a handful of dates in December in Florida with our good friends Holly Hunt, which is another LP that uh, I worked on, wrapped up, and I think, I can't wait to see where they're going. They've done a lot awesome. um, in the first year they've been around. So yeah, Holly Hunt, awesome. We're doing uh, some shows with them. Uh, Rick, our drummer's other band, Post Teens. Okay. They're also on some of the shows, and that'll be just the end of a very long year for us. Right on. And then we'll start writing uh, January, February, and we'll be on the road spring through this time next year. Awesome, very cool. Yeah. Well, hey man, I just want to thank you for taking some time with Blow the Scene readers from around the world. We really appreciate it, and we definitely look forward to keeping up with your future endeavors with Torch and Shitstorm and all the other awesome projects you got going on. Awesome, man. Thank you. Awesome.